Situated in the Beskid Sądecki region, Krynica Zdrój, with its unique highland climate and rich history, is one of the oldest Polish spa towns. First visitors seeking treatment came here in the late 18th century. Gradually, the place developed into the most popular spa town in Poland, and, since the early 20th century, it has retained this status. Krynica Zdrój is the seat of a municipality comprising villages which are highly attractive to tourists. One of these is Tylicz, known for its history going back to the medieval time. From here you can set off to nearby Slovakia and further to the south of Europe. Visitors come to Krynica in large numbers throughout the year, because the place has numerous attractions on offer in winter and in summer. In fact, you will also enjoy yourself in Krynica on chilly and rainy days in spring or in autumn, because time always flows here in a leisurely pace. You're welcome to come here and see for yourself. Healing properties of the water from the local springs were reported on as early as the beginning of the 18th century. Today, seven mineral springs are in use. You can take a sip of the healing water in a few pump rooms. The central pump room has been located along the promenade for 100 years and in the current building for 50 years. Besides other types, the pump room serves water from the main spring. In fact, this is the spring that gave rise to the spa town. The building also houses a concert hall regularly hosting performances of the Krynica Spartan Orchestra. Also along the promenade in the old mineral baths you can visit another pump room. Here you can have the mineral water called Zuber. In the vicinity of Tillich there are ample resources of mineral water too. The best known is the spring in the spa park, at the location where merchants travelling along the Hungarian route used to stop in the past centuries. It was in Krynica that the first Polish mineral water bottling plant was launched. The water was delivered in stoneware tanks all over Galicia. Today, sold in bottles, the water is as tasty and refreshing as it was in the past. Over the years, visitors seeking treatment have been attracted to Krynica not only by its mineral springs, but also by the increasingly impressive spa houses. Today, these fascinating historical buildings largely contribute to the unique atmosphere of this spa town. Before the war, this was a glamorous holiday resort for the high society. The banquets held here were as famous as the mineral water itself. In the 19th century and then throughout the interwar and post-war decades, the spa resort in Krynica was administered by the state. The major spa facilities were built here with the support of the state authorities. This tradition is continued today. The historical buildings have been meticulously restored. Oozing their old-fashioned appeal, nowadays they provide high-quality services. Visitors can enjoy stylish rooms which are both elegant and cozy. The facilities with very well-trained staff and advanced equipment provide treatment for patients with metabolic conditions, motor disorders, neurological problems or upper airway diseases. These beautiful spa houses, where tradition meets modernity, create unique ambience owing to which the treatment is even more effective and the leisure time even more enjoyable. The facilities built here over the years and operating successfully today include spa houses owned by various private and public entities. They provide spa therapies to patients entitled to the refund from the Polish national healthcare system or the visitors who pay for the stay themselves. The therapeutic programs include a wide range of top quality medical and rehabilitation treatments. And the comfortable accommodation will satisfy the expectations of even most demanding guests. 
Some of the old private spa houses have been restored to their former glory by the owners truly passionate about the local heritage. The atmosphere of the olden days in Krynica is brought back by the guest houses with a historical lineage. They are always open to the guests coming for a holiday or a short break. If these hotel corridors, rooms and alcoves could speak, the stories would make up the longest TV series ever. Over the years, Krynica has been visited by celebrities, politicians, artists and all those who wanted to enjoy their leisure time. The historical buildings have been restored and furnished to match the modern facilities built here in large numbers in the recent years. Owing to this, accommodation options available locally are greatly varied, ranging from luxury hotels to agro-tourist farms. They all offer services of fine quality. They are available in the center of Krynica, in Czarny Potok, near Mount Jaworzyna, in Słotwiny, Tylicz and in other nearby villages. Even if the weather is bad, you can spend a day here in a very satisfying way. Many facilities offer a wide range of spa therapies and wellness treatment. Both adults and children can enjoy a variety of activities and games, and they can have a great time. Gourmet eaters will definitely appreciate the hotel and guest house restaurants with a full board option. Certainly, the restaurants are open not only to the hotel guests, but to all enthusiasts of fine cuisine. And fine cuisine will not do without delicious wild mushrooms. The main square in Tillich has retained its urban layout since the Middle Ages. There are also other historical landmarks. The unique local attractions include the Mofetta, a natural place where carbon dioxide is discharged, producing lots of bubbling and puffing pools. Hiking routes lead from Tillich into the mountains and forests. You can also take a trip along the ravine of the river Mushinka. In Krynica, you must first take a walk down the Dietla Boulevard and Novotarskiego Avenue along the Krynichanka stream. The walk will take less than 20 minutes. A must-see for every visitor, the promenade is located at the heart of the spa town. In fact, this may be the most renowned pedestrian precinct in Poland. The place has been connected with the history of this spa town since the very beginning. Along the promenade you will see many old villas and spa facilities, as well as other landmarks and monuments of history. The walk will take you to Polana Janówka, where you can drink the mineral water called Jan. The pump room was built of larch wood during the interwar period. In the vicinity there is a station where you can get on a train to the top of Mount Parkova. The trip takes three minutes. This is the first funicular railway built in Poland. It operates all year long, attracting many tourists. On top of Mount Parkowa you can enjoy the spa park, the only one in Poland situated on a hill. There are a lot of places worth visiting here. You can contemplate the figure of Our Lady of the Springs in Krynica, founded by spa visitors. You can admire the lovely ponds and, if you are thirsty, drink some water from Bocianówka Spring. You must also visit the oldest church in Krynica, situated nearby. Mount Jaworzyna is well known to enthusiasts of skiing, but it is also an interesting destination for tourists in all the seasons. You can take the cable car to the top, or you can get there on foot or by bike. The scenery is unforgettable. 
You should also visit the Słotwiński Park. Here you can see the oldest preserved building in Krynica, the pump room once located at the promenade. Another landmark here is the Brine Graduation Tower. At the outskirts of the park you can see a pavilion once used by the Spartan Orchestra, today housing a restaurant. The area of Słotwiny has a unique attraction, a scenic tower. To get to the top, you must walk up a one kilometer long path among trees. The view of the nearby area is magnificent, and the tower is open all year long. A well-known skiing center, known as the Swatfine Arena, operates nearby. If the dining options were the only attraction here, visitors would still come in large numbers to Krynica Zdruj. You'll never get hungry here. Street vendors selling regional products will take care of you when you take a walk. They offer only good things – honey, various kinds of juice and the best cheese in the world. You can take a bite of seafood – straight from Krynica, of course. You can also enjoy a large variety of dishes and the local chefs will definitely know how to make you happy. There are plenty of restaurants representing Highlander style, small and cozy as well as luxury establishments with lush furnishings and impressive designs. They serve tasty dishes, sometimes exotic, sophisticated and refined. However, it's the local dishes that taste best here made from products straight from the orchards, forests or mountain streams. And the orchestra is playing. A cup of coffee after a great lunch is an excellent idea, especially if it is made in a real espresso machine by a superb barista. You can have a nice cup of latte or americano in small coffee shops and atmospheric cafeterias all over the town. And coffee goes well with a dessert, perhaps the local style ice cream. Enjoy! Cold winter is a time of joy, definitely for those staying in Krynica Zdruj. Owing to the specific microclimate, this mountainous area offers excellent conditions for winter sports for a few months each year. However, it's not only because of the fine natural environment that the ski slopes in Krynica and Tilic are so popular. The place is also known for the fine ski resorts with versatile services on offer. A gondola lift, chair lifts, surface lifts, equipment rental, restaurants, sanitary facilities and most importantly well-maintained ski runs of very difficulty. Have fun! A horse is a horse, of course. This is a well-known fact. On the other hand, the ability to ride on horseback is a more complex matter. To find out how beautiful and fascinating it is, you must practice in a riding school. If you prefer four wheels, you will definitely enjoy off-roading in the areas surrounding Krynica. You can take trips to places with amazing scenery, or you can follow more extreme routes. Swimming means health and fitness, but most of all, it is good fun. The swimming pool in Tillich is open in the summer and a few indoor facilities in Knica operate in all the seasons. Obviously, there are bike rentals and routes following paved roads and tourist trails, as well as the more demanding mountain biking trails. Those with daring hearts and agile bodies, unafraid of heights, can enjoy two adventure parks. <laughs> the 
In Krynica, you can go skating in all seasons. The ice ring operates here for 10 months per year. You can rent the equipment and have fun at the ice skating disco. There are two churches in the main square in Tiric. The smaller wooden one is one of the oldest landmarks of the region. The old painting of Our Lady, which for centuries has attracted pilgrims, has been transferred to the new parish church. Nearby you can see the ways of Holy Mary and Golgotha. The old town hall today houses a museum. Its exhibits include regional costumes of Polish and Wemko people, household items from various historical periods, furniture, utensils and tools used by artisans and farmers. As well as exhibits related to anti-Russian insurgents in the 18th century. The old Greek Catholic churches tell the story of Wemko people and their Polish neighbors. The Greek Catholic church in Swotfine is also well maintained by the local people. Most of its furnishings have been brought here from the parish church located in the central part of Krynica. You can see miniatures of the religious landmarks of the Beskid region at the exhibition near the church. The Church of the Apostles Peter and Paul is the largest brick church in the Beskid region. It was regained by the Greek Catholic community several years ago. The parish is rather small, but very dynamic. It runs a gallery of contemporary icons, which are created during international workshops held in Novica. Baptized in the Church of the Apostles, Nikifor, the most famous person from Krynica, was famous for his naive paintings. Believed to be mentally challenged, he was a self-taught artist who'd paint over any kind of material. Owing to those who admired his work, Nikifor gained recognition and relative financial stability in the final years of his life. The world-famous tenor singer Jan Kepura also loved this town. He both performed and relaxed here. The spa town regularly hosts concerts, competitions and festivals paying tribute to him. Painful memories of World War II in Krynica are brought back by the monument dedicated to soldiers. The spa town orchestra has not been ordered with a memorial, but it definitely deserves recognition. The orchestra has been here since the 19th century. It can be admired in the central pump room in all the seasons and on an open-air stage in the summer. It's not only spa treatments, sports and trips, but also other fun attractions that make your leisure time a success. In fact, there are a lot of options to be enjoyed in Krynica Zdruj. Alpine courses, slides, inflatables, ferry trains, pedal go-karts. Anything goes. For little kids, for big children and for adults. A walk down the promenade is a great pleasure because many things happen here each day. You can relax in the parks or in the roofs areas and you can take a break from all the worries of your daily life. You can forget about the whole world when you sit at the multimedia fountain and listen to Kepura. Shopping can also be great fun, especially when you look for gifts and souvenirs. There is a museum which is particularly appealing to children but adults taking this sentimental journey will also be overjoyed spending the whole day with their happy memories. 
Finally, no spa town can do without this. Your stay here would not be so enjoyable without dancing parties. This is what Kalitsa is like. A modern spa town with an atmosphere of old times. Małopolska is an enchanting place with a plentitude of attractions not to be found anywhere else. We suggest a trip to its beautiful spa towns. You can see these in a series of videos available on the website and via our application. This film about Kalitsa's Drew is over, but it will be followed by videos presenting other amazing resort towns. Make sure you watch them!